Hello, I'm here to tell you about advanced drawing and design and digital visualization. These are two of the high school technology education courses that are offered in WJCC schools. Advanced drawing and design. This course offers experience in 2D and 3D modeling techniques applicable to careers such as engineering, architecture, interior design, graphic arts, and game design. AutoCAD professional software and Inventor professional are used to enhance the curriculum and develop skills in computer-aided design systems. During virtual or online classes, Onshape will be the application used. Here are the units of study that are covered in advanced drawing and design. Here are some examples of single view drawings. Here is another example of single view drawing that is on a title block and borders. Then we get into orthographic projection drawings. This is where we're going to take three dimensional objects and using a technique called orthographic projection, create the top, front, and right side views. Please notice that correct annotation will be taught. Here's an example of auxiliary projection. And then we get finally into working drawings. This is where we're actually going to create separate parts, put them together as assemblies, and then create the individual drawings with dimensions and tolerances, and then also the drawing of the assembly itself. Finally, an exploded view will be created and this exploded view will also contain a bill of materials. As an added byproduct, we'll be creating an assembly video. Next, we'll talk about digital visualization. Students will gain experiences related to computer animation by using graphics and design concepts. Students solve problems involving 3D object manipulation, storyboarding, texture and mapping, lighting concepts, environmental geometry. Students create a variety of animations that reflect real world applications and are introduced to, the, to interactive and 3D animation software. Here's an example of 3D object manipulation. Here's an example of storyboarding. An example of working with lighting concepts. And then here is an example of environmental geometry. And what I'm showing you here is a student project in 3D animation. This was created about two years ago. If you have any questions, please submit your questions through the curriculum fair question link provided in the WJCC family newsletter. Or you may contact me, thomas.knuckles at wjccschools.org or you may contact your school counselor or a technology education teacher at your school. Thank you for your interest and time.